Well, I have been working as a stonemason for 23 years, but I haven't been born and brought up in the area. When I was about to retire, I didn't want to retire because the place, I suppose, has a hold over me. It's such a, a, a wonderful building. It's had a lot of weddings, it's had large funeral services. Uh, the Duke of Athol had a memorial service in here. There was uh, clan chiefs and their feather bonnets, everything in here. It was, I mean, it's used for lots and lots of things. It's a fabulous place. The cathedral is a, that's a beautiful place to play. Um, I think all these old buildings, you feel a sense of um, history. You know, it's there, it's, it's been there for so long. It's, and, and you can't help feel but part of that. And also the, the sound in these places is really special um, because you get such a, you know, as a, as a musician, you're always play, you play to sound, the sound of the room. And, uh, and the cathedral actually gives you back this amazing, feeling you can hear the sound just drifting around the space and, um, and so it feels good and it sounds good and uh, it's great there's nothing quite like it actually when you put on a show in a place like Dunkeld Cathedral you come across a whole range of different challenges that you wouldn't normally encounter if you were using a typical concert venue like a theatre or concert hall Everywhere you turn, there's different relics and ancient artefacts, and um, so you've got to be extra careful when you're getting everything set up. You also know the place means so much to so many people, so I think it's a real privilege to be able to use it and share it with our audience. I started Scotland look after the nave, and that's where I did all my work. Uh, cutting out and, and uh, dressing and forming new stones, building them in. And uh, you would get the Americans coming in and they would say, what a boring, monotonous job. And I said, no, because my name's Sinclair and Bishop Sinclair built the biggest part of it. And I said, I was destined to work here uh, and repair what was already built here. And I can come along here in my old age with a stick and say, look at that to my grandchildren. I built that in such and such a year. It's just it's part of me.